Bob's your uncle, it's so easy. Yeah, there you go. You got it. What a weird It's like saying, term. hey presto. What? Hello, I'm Jimmy. And I'm Tate. I am from uh, Birmingham in the UK. And I'm from Calgary, Canada. And we're going to do British versus Canadian slang. Do you know much British slang, Tate? No. Do you know any Canadian slang? Uh, no. Do you want to go first? <laughs> I wonder who the Brit is in the room. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, skiving. Mm, yeah. Mm. Yeah, familiar with that one. Like spying, like sky driving. Are you thinking of skydiving? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So you do a lot of that yeah. here in the UK. That's actually incorrect. <laughs> Weirdly. Really? Yeah. really? Yeah. Oh my god, what is it? <laughs> if you were to <laughs> pretend to be unwell okay. to get a day off work, okay, that'd sicky. be skiving. Yeah, it'd be sicky or oh, skiving. Wow. So avoiding work. So I've had a lifetime of skiving. Perfect. Mickey. 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 Okay. Like the mouse. Okay. <laughs> well, it's like uh, it's like when you put like alcohol in. It's like a little a little Mickey of vodka. Mickey of like sour puss. You can like put it in your pocket. Oh, and you can, like, okay. Yeah. Genius. So genius. I need a Mickey. <laughs> you need a Mickey. Can we get a Mickey, guys? Yeah. Let's get a Mickey. Let's Come on. In here. Next one. Okay. Chin wag. Think about it literally. I think it's literally just like hairs on your chin. Like the gross, the gross three <laughs> the hairs that guys grow. They have like three hairs and they're like, oh look at my facial hair. What would a chin be doing if it was, if it was wagging? <laughs> oh, are you talking? Yes! Wow! Stop chin wagging and skiving and get back to work. Brain makes everything so complicated. <laughs> like just call it talking. Toonie. T-O-O-N-I-E. Toonie. A silly character. Okay. Someone who's silly. Okay. <laughs> oh, I'm so hot in this polyester suit. Oh my god. Okay, taking the Mickey. That's like. Well, what is it then? It's like it's like a sarcastic comment. You're taking the Mickey because those pants are nice, but they're not really pants. They're not really good pants. That's what it'd be like, right? Exactly. Okay. Exactly that. That is taking. Just the roasting Mickey. you. <laughs> and that is a British pastime. We do that a lot. I feel like I'm learning here. Me too. Timbits. Timbits. Oh, Timbits, I know this. There's a coffee shop in Canada uh -huh. that everyone loves uh -huh. called Tim Hortons. Yes. Yay! It's like a little it's like oh, a like. little mini donut. And like oh, they sound good. Justin Bieber literally just like made a Timbit. Is that the dream for you one day? Tim? Yeah, for sure. You have your own Timbits. Get into line. the Tim Hortons business. Yeah. You've made it. Bob's your uncle. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> and he like he could be like your uncle. Mm. Bob, he's like in your, they're like in your, he's like in your family. <laughs> he's like in your family. He could use it in that context right. if you did have an uncle called Bob. <laughs> but it means something else as well. Uh, let me try and use it in a sentence. Okay, it's really easy to make pancakes. You take um, egg, flour, and some milk, mix it together. Bob's your uncle, you got a pancake. What? Like the complication thing is crazy. Like we're talking about eggs. No, don't focus on that. That's just an Bob's example. Bob's your uncle. That's not specific related to pancakes. I'm trying no, to. No, yeah, it. it's like it's like oh, it's like easy. You're like Bob's your uncle. It's so easy. Yeah, there you go. You got it. What a weird. It's like saying term. hey presto. What? Well, I feel like I'm ready to become an honorary Canadian now. Yeah, I think I'm a Brit now. Yeah, we can welcome you in. Yeah. Right, bring Tate Amazing. out her polyester Union Jack suit, please. <laughs> I'm next. There you go. That was us doing British versus Canadian slang. You can watch more of this on Global Player.